Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome back to another reaction packed episode of Krista Butcher, our friends. Right, it's currently Sunday the 3rd of March 2024. It is Sunday because in the background all you can hear is the tumble dryer. Kids uniform, my uniform, lose a clothes for the next few days. Always on a Sunday, Sunday is wash day. <laughs> That was me pretending to be an old Victorian woman on, on front in a bucket with a washboard. <laughs> right, I never forget that. Right, I'm doing a, a piece of lamb, as you can see it down there, a piece of a bone rolled shoulder. I did purchase it from work and it was six pounds. Uh, I, I've also, while we're at religion, last week, in fact, I picked the whole thing up, found them. They smell fabulous. The Maggie's Bouillon Cubes. So, I'm going to take two of them. Yeah. Two of them bad boys. I'm going to dissolve them in some water. I'm going to pour that on that. You guessed it. In a cooking bag. Well, that is our Maggie's uh, bouillon mix uh, done. Uh, we've got our lamb already in our cooking bag. I've got my blue tab here, as you can see. There's my blue tab. And uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pour this in here. I'm going to leave it. I know it says put it on its side, but I'm going to leave it like that because I want it to cook. And I want it. Oh, well, I do want to use this as. I want to use this as the gravy as well. So. What I'm going to do is get that side up. Back to that side a bit further up so it's got a bit of room to grow. There we are. We sit there, you've seen me do this a million times before I can't pick this up off the top. <laughs> Beat my sausage fingers. Right, making it. Right in there, I think. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, play it again. Play it again. Fucking hell. Me and, me and fiddly things don't mix, I'm telling you now. Right, I think I'm getting somewhere now. Put it that way, yeah. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Right, we're getting somewhere now. Right, there we go. That is there. That is hot, by the way. So I want to see if it'll sit like that and stay like that in the bag. As you can see. Well, yeah, we're all over the shop here, aren't we? Right, there we are. That is our lamb in our bag. And we'll see that in an hour and 30 minutes. Oh, by the way, the oven's on 180. 200 if it's not fan assisted. Well, it's been an hour and 30 minutes. And it smells good in this kitchen right now. So, I'm just about to get it out of the oven, take my glasses off, because otherwise I won't be able to see nothing. And we're going to get it on the chopping block. Yay, glasses are coming off. 
Now, the bag has leaked, but I am not awfully bothered. You can't really see anything right there, can you? The lamp, I'm, I'm, it's got to be cooked in there. I've basically boiled the hell out of it in a cooking bag in 180 degrees for 90 minutes. Now, I'm not bad about this going into the pan because I want, I'm going to drain that into a pan, into a raw in a saucepan for me juices. Watch your juices. Eee, that's hot. Watch your juices. Oh, Christ almighty. You see it running now. Look at that. Woo. It's like a tsunami of Maggie and lamb goodness. Wow, that's hot. And it has shrunk a little bit. In fact, it's shrunk quite a lot. But there it is. Now that, for me, is cooked. Not bothered about lamb being a bit pink in the middle, but I don't think that is going to be. We will slice it when it's cooled down and rested for 20 minutes. So, uh, in the meantime, I'll get in there, because camera's in where, I'm going to get that out, get that in a saucepan, and uh, we'll crack on with our lamb at the Sunday dinner. So there is the boneless shoulder lamb that I cooked in the bag with the Maggie's bouillon, or well, stock cubes, basically. Bouillon is a, a posh word for stock cubes, or French word for stock cubes. So uh, I don't know how you're going to see this, I don't know. I, I'm, going to, I'm going to put it this way so I can get my hand on it. Now, I know, I know you're a bit out of the way there. But I will turn you around in a minute. Well, I'll turn this around in a minute so you can see. In fact, I'll do that right now before I carry on slicing it. There it is. That is our boneless shoulder lamb cooked in a cooking bag with Maggie's stock cubes and it smells fabulous. I've still got my gravy yet. I just added the broccoli juice in there. Uh, I've not finished it yet. I've got some spuds on here now. Just uh, boiling off a little bit so I can do some roast potatoes in the old tannic. Uh, I've got some uh, carrots and I've got some parsnips and that should be it. Not doing mash because there's only me and Connor eating mash and I always make far too much and it's just a waste. So, bang, bish bash bosh, that looks and smells fabulous. Next time you see it, it'll be on a plate with all the sundries getting drowned in a load of fabulous gravy. So there is the end result of my cook in the bag lamb with the uh, Maggie's uh, stock cubes or bouillon as they're called. You know, to make it sound a bit posher. And the only thing we need to do now is to put some good old lamb gravy on it, which is there. I Yes, I have put some bisto in it. Shoot me. But I needed to thicken it up. And it, it does still smell very lammy. So that is good. So uh, let's do it. sisters is orgasmic right I'm gonna get a knife and fork I'm gonna slide a bit of this down me gizzard so let's get it done uh, I, I cooked them the parsnips and the carrots in the air fryer in in, in a cooking bag with some butter and pepper so well, I, didn't, I didn't do that because I don't want to overkill the cooking bags even I've used it three times already right there is the lamb It's coming apart on my fork, so it is shoulder, so it's going to be a bit fatty. The lamp, the grave is a bit fatty, but hey, look at that. Oh, I'd say, oh, look at it. Mmm, Demi gives a bon apple tea. That is superb. Mmm. Lammy, beautiful.
obviously it's only superb if you like lamb in it carrot cooked in butter and pepper come on yes mm. parsnip cooked exactly the same way come on not a massive fan of parsnips i'll be honest i really only cook them for Lou because Lou loves them me i could drop to kick them to end the garden really couldn't give a shit about them broccoli's broccoli as kieran calls it broccoli is cruelty to kids <laughs> But you know what? It's good for you. Uh, roast potatoes. Let's cut them. I'll cut them in old tenic as well. Nice and uh, not not. You know what I mean? They don't never come out the same as if you do them in the oven in goose fat or duck fat. But you know what? End of the day, superb. Hmm. Fucking hot though. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what, brothers and sisters? I don't even know what I'm going to call that yet. Uh, mate, I don't really want to call it cooking the bag lamb. Uh, but it, it did involve the Maggie's, uh, the Maggie's seasoning. These are found in Tesco's for three quid. There's about, I think there's 30 stock cubes in there. It should tell you on it. 60. 60 stock cubes. I guarantee it goes to show I can't count. I've always been shit at maths. But then, ah, uh, just the smell, the smell coming off the packet through the, through the wrappers is absolutely fabulous. So, yeah, I've got a load of them to do. So, an influx of Maggie's seasoned uh, steaks, chicken, beef, pork, cooked in a bag, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, March is coming up. March is here, I mean. March is here. Uh, I want to try and get a bit more active here on YouTube. Uh, I've been a bit. I've let you. I've, I think I. I feel like I've let you guys down because I've not been very active, and that's because I've been that fucking busy uh, with work, uh, with the bouncy castles as well. Don't forget, it's not. I don't just do bouncy castles on YouTube. I've got a job as well now, so I have. A, I started that bloody hell uh, over a year ago. Or so uh, I'm going to try and uh, get more content out for you guys. I don't want to go down the, the super cool review route as such, even though I've got a freezer full of shit to do. Because, uh, I, I, you know what I mean? I, I, I enjoy doing them, but I enjoy doing shit like this more. You know, like producing something like a proper tea with veg on it. and You know what I mean? Something that's a bit more accomplished than sticking some uh, sticking something from Iceland in fucking air fryer that takes. It takes about an hour to fucking cook. Eat, review, upload. Do you know what I mean? But I, there is a few of them coming. But I, you know I mean, I, that's, this is where my passion is the cooking. So, yeah, I'm digressing. I'm talking. I'm boring you to sleep. Uh, I've, I have been described as being able to talk a glass eye to sleep, which I'm doing right now. So, yeah, fuck it. Right. I enjoyed it. If you like this, press like. Comment, share it on your social media, and subscribe. I'll make up a family member of Tech Team CTB, where I fucking love you. I spat then. You see it? <laughs>